Yo, right, hello everyone, and welcome back to my Crusader Kings 2 series, where today we are, of course, still playing as the Principality of Amalfi, with our now 48-year-old Grand Prince Baslake the Fowler, and today, my friends, we are finally at war with Bulgaria, and I'm happy about that, especially after... Well, let's be frank, my usual uh, forgetfulness of certain mechanics in this game in the last episode with the whole weak claim thing. In my defense, towards the end of the episode, I did finally realize, oh yeah, it's probably because of the whole weak claim thing. That's why I was trying to kill off that one family, get their castle, to then hand over to one of the carlings that had a stronger claim. But thankfully, our weak claim came through. So we're actually fighting. And also, why do I have 250 people on Venice? I haven't, I haven't called up my army. I, I was about to, because I decided I should probably raise my demense troops. Oh, you must have been from the, uh, that castle, Palestrina. Okay. All right, well, I'm about to call up on it, all of my troops anyways to help in this war and make it go more quickly. So, what the hell, I'll leave you there and we'll pick you up on boat. So let's just go ahead and uh, start with that. Okay, so yes, I still have people over here. Let's pick you up by boat. And load. And just go meet in Astoria. That's where I'll get everyone to go to. You combine and boat. And there. And you know what? Actually, all of you guys go here. I'll just take you by boat across. That'll work. And you. You're going to need boats, too. Actually. You know what? Let's change the boats. I think with the boats I've already raised, I can probably pick up all of my forces, potentially. So why waste money by raising even more boats? So let's unpause and get things going. Oh, uh, off camera, I did bribe some more people in these factions, and hey, they all went down. Independence was, oh, hey, wow, the other one went just completely, they're both gone. Oh, jeez, yeah, I bribed all the right people. <laughs> both of these were in the upper 80%, and they lost a couple of folks there. God bless my crap loads of cat. Oh, the factions are back. Ah, the Independence one, they're at 70. Meh to them. All right, all of you, on to all of you. Was that all the boats? Did I get you guys? Yes, yes, you're all there, perfect. All right, we'll just drop you off up here. Have you walk towards our war zone. And watch these sieges, make sure things all go nicely for us. Ah, perfect. All right, now you can go away. Excellent, and I'm gonna move you right there. That seems sensible. I don't I don't know how large their army is, so maybe I might move them over to another area. So I don't know if I need Wow, we just had a tiny little battle of them trying to raise troops there. You fools! And someone usurping crap from a family member. Ah oh boy. Close all of you, I don't care. I'm watching Bulgaria. And also this. Hmm. Increase council power. Ah, the bastards. What is this? Uh, just the county of Constantinople. I mean... Sure, I'm probably never going to get a chance to use it, but might as well have a claim. What the hell? I actually completely forgot that he was there doing that still. Kind of pointless now that we're going after Bulgaria. This is probably going to end up being my last war, but... Still, <laughs> might as well keep trying to get claims there. I have no idea if it'll help me out or not in EU4. All right, this voice calling to me, telling me I was a bad person, telling me how evil I was. Well, you are possessed. Apparently, Jesus is calling me. Really? Negative vassal temple vassal opinion? Huh. I don't know how that makes sense. So, so in the medieval period where people are like super crazy religious and I have Jesus apparently talking to me, the temple vassals don't like me, but I get, I, I'm going to get piety for it still. 
That doesn't make sense to me in the slightest. Oh well! Yeah, the Pope's gonna be mad. <laughs> Isn't he always? Which actually reminds me, does he have money? No, he never has money. <laughs> Alright, yeah, you know what? I'll just keep these guys here. We'll just siege out a lot of territory. We're already up to 13%. What is this? Who are you? You're my family. You, We would like you to back our plot to fabricate against Abyssinia. He kind of likes me right now, and you... Uh, Abyssinia likes me more. I'm gonna decline. There we go. Go away. Ha, ah, all right. Well, now the the fun part about wars, the long sieges. Oh boy. Hmm. Kind of debating if I should split up some of these forces a bit more. I'm not entirely sure. Actually, I do think I will a bit. Um I don't want to split in half. Oh no, four army sieging. That's that's fine for the time being. And we got another siege, we're up to 22%. Take that! Take that, Bulgaria! Kinda wanna actually go enemy hunting with this one. <laughs> Ooh, you've only got one more siege to do before you're done. Uh the Emperor is not uh, happy with another one of my trade posts. Too bad! Point out that the trade post is great. Got another siege, perfect. God, I hope this war goes well and quickly. I need it to go quickly. <laughs> All right, how are you doing? You've almost got that one it's sorted. Okay, you know what? New unit. How do I want to split this up? Oh boy, oh boy. You know what, a thousand of you. Good, good, good. And y you. Yes, that should be good. All right, select unit. You go here. And you. Let's do the same. Let's uh, create a new unit here. And you. Ooh, that's a bit too many. Nope. You. Still too many. Oh, this one better. You go here. And young Alicia, a courtier, uh, good for her as a tough soldier. Too bad it's a medieval period, and that's really not going to help her much. <laughs> uh, oh, hey, we can siege out this territory, too. Oh, s screw my current movement. You know what? Just go here. <laughs> I'm spreading a little bit more thin than I would prefer, but you know what? What the hell? We've got the troops. Let's do a little carpet sieging. Some good old carpet sieging fun. Try and get as much as we can as quick as we can. That's what we really need to be doing right now. Hey, a battle and a siege. What was the battle? Did just another random singular soldier happen upon one of my armies? <laughs> uh, I'm always amused when they even call those battles, but you know, eh, oh well. Also, who are you? County of Heaves. You're at war. Oh no, you're just in defensive pact against the HRE. <gasps> you're a fellow possessed person. Why won't you become a vassal? <gasps> Offer vassalization. Ah, crap, you won't. <sighs> I may just have to take him. He would be an awkward hole in my empire. Hmm. I want your county. <laughs> ah, he's not a direct vassal. Of course not. And what is this? As I retired to my chambers, I was fine. Oh, God, the Orthodox Bible. Uh, no. I'll become paranoid. Wait, aren't I already paranoid? Yes, another battle of someone, just a single person running into my army. You fool. All right, let's go over here. Probably could siege out these so the Byzantines don't get it but actually nope hey someone has all that who is that huh I don't know well you go yeah you just go over there 
What the hell? Despite being able to help with my latest war, my friend King Imar chose to ignore my plight. No. Oh, well, apparently we lost a little bit of relationship there. Oh boy, hi! Ooh, more of you are pissed. Huh. Well, time to send more gifts out to people. <laughs> I got plenty of cash. Oh wow, you're real cheap. It's actually not going to help because it's not going to get your opinion up enough. But, not you, you. Can I send a gift to you? Nope, already did. There's the Pope. Ooh, can't send anything to him. It'd be pointless, but what the hell, it's cheap. <laughs> already sent the thing to you. Ha! <laughs> uh, I find it amusing that Serene Doge Robin the Holy... We'll take a bribe of 666 gold for 66 points of influence. I like it. <laughs> oh, it's perfect. Uh, oh, man, a lot of these people can be bribed. I think they're just joining the, these factions just to get bribed at this point, frankly. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's cool. Uh, you. No, you, you suck. Nah, it's not going to make a difference. Well, I actually should get rid of a lot of them. Oh, yep, numbers are dropping. I've been so quick to judge, I realize it now. The voice reminds me that I should seek what is good for all. Apparently, I'm getting patient. Okay. Hmm. How are the factions? They lowered, but not as well. No, they're still lowering a bit. And then they went back. Oh, they went up and then down. Ha. Huh. I'm worried that you... Oh, oh god, someone else joined. Who the... Uh, you... I hate you. My sin is too great, so I must show repentance. I care not what others think. Heaven is only for the truly repentant. Wait, why am I going all holy all of a sudden? I'm freaking a possessed lunatic. I don't... I don't get it. Also, we're getting really old. This is terrifying. I need to maybe look for a new heir. Uh, oh, 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 boy. I also need this war to go really well. Oh, we're already at 73%. I hadn't been paying attention to that percentage. Good. Good. I hear him whispering to me that it is for me to glory God. Not to leave it unto others. I shall do thus and be more diligent in my tasks. Apparently, I'm diligent now. Huh. I don't like that after the last few of those events have occurred, there's been an ominous bell toll. <laughs> uh, <laughs> seems like, oh god, a peasant revolt. Also, how are these going? Eh, better, better. A little controlled for the time being. Uh, peasant revolt. Where? Hold on. Zoom in. And move. Uh, solve your crap. 1,000 you. Uh, 1,000 uh, you. 10,000! Boop. <laughs> Alright, let's take care of this. Destroy the weak peasants. The foolish fools who decided to attack my land. Oh, I'm. Man, you know what? Just jump right in there. <laughs> Let's give them some uh, at least half decent troops or commanders. Someone just what? Someone just how did my houses just suddenly get booped around? All right, you. I understand why you went. There we go. And that was solved for me. <laughs> you know what? Wait, hold on. You were who did I raise you from? Portugal. Portugal. Do you like and or hate me? You're kind of indifferent. He kind of likes me right now. I'll, I'll, I'll get rid of his troops in our territory. If he would have been one of the ones hating me, I would have disbanded his troops in, over here in Scotland. Which still amuses me that that's Scotland, but oh well. You know, we're about to win this war. Oh god, yeah, we also already won the other war. All for peace! Enforced demands. And this fella... Eh, we'll 
we'll just banish. Change of pace. We haven't banished in a while. How are you doing? Okay, better. 86! We're up to 86% on this. We got another siege about to pop. Another one here getting close. We might be done with this war in record time. Holy crap. The Bul uh, Bulgaria is really, really easy. Surprisingly easy. Hello, what are you? Uh, to the proud Grand Prince Baslake, peace be with you. We surrender under these terms. Hmm. I want total victory. <laughs> Screw you, Bulgaria! Screw you! We will win our way. I believe I would have gotten everything I wanted out of that victory, but you know what? I, I want total victory. Total and complete victory. And it will be glorious. And even with all these troops, holy crap, we're still making money. Another siege is done! 99%! Once this one finishes, we'll be at 100 Oh, what is this? After years of careful planning, it's blah, 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 I raised a large enough army. Oh, we have a host army. Wait, why did those sieges not get us to 100%? Well, let's enforce demands. Baron Werner of Versa. Yeah, we should win. On pause. And, yes, look at all the glorious purple, and holy crap, we're threatening now, 50. <laughs> yes, we have won, we have won. Let's pause and gaze upon our newly, oh my god, look at Russia. <laughs> yes, take that Byzantine Empire. Take that. And, amusingly, our vassal limit actually went up with those bonuses that I got from all those events. And our number of vassals didn't change because he was already one of my vassals. <laughs> yes. Oh my god, look at how much territory we control. Oh, it's beautiful. What is the defensive pact against me going to be now? Well, right now, no one, but I'm pretty sure it's going to start up, and it's going to start up real damn quickly. Ha! <laughs> uh, we have claims, huh? <laughs> that, that actually went a lot more quickly than I thought it would. I honestly thought we might be, you know, taking five years or so for that to happen. Huh. Wait, what? Breaking the... I have a truce with him? How do I have a truce with you? I don't... I don't know. But okay, so I'm not gonna attack you. Hmm. We could always take their capital. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, we got a lot of claims in here. Mostly crap ones, though, frankly. A lot of cities. Hmm. Yeah, a lot of individual wars we could do against them, but... <laughs> oh, it would take us so long. More things. You, who are you? You're a revolt. Who are you revolting against? Where are you? Where are you? Ooh, ooh. Hi, Lithuanian revolt. <laughs> uh, and then you. I could claim... Shh. Like a holy war. I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind a holy war. <laughs> we could holy war for Kiev! My god. God. Huh. Huh. I'm trying to think of what my next move is here now. We are just freaking gigantic. And I have my armies already primed. Maybe it's time for you to die. 
<laughs> Except I can't! Ah, I got nothing on you. Offer vassalization! I am so much larger than you. How can you say no? <laughs> I, I surround you. I could just... Uh, I want to occupy him. <laughs> Holy crap, I can't get over how much land we have now. This is, this is glorious. <laughs> oh, I need to go and attack so many more things. Hmm. Oh boy, that's loud outside. You guys may or may not be able to hear, but there's an ice cream truck going down my road right now, playing that, uh, you know, typical music. Huh, Kiev, huh? Hmm. Is there another group called Kiev? Because that's... How do I holy war that? Hold on. Let's go here. Yeah, what Kiev is this? Oh, you have a little piece of land there. Oh, okay, okay. So many holy war possibilities. Let's look at the vassal map. Bulgaria is large, but I do have other large vassals to sort of keep them in check. Germany, how are you doing? You seem to be mostly intact again. Good for you, good for you. Or are you, are you Aquitaine? Yeah, you're Aquitaine. All right, well, let's unpause. Let's uh, lower my armies, at least my normal armies for now. Go away. Oh, God, I'm going to have to combine all of you guys at some place. Uh, combine here so I can split you up a bit. Ah, defensive pact against me, of course, of course. We all knew that it was coming. With 50% freaking threat, of course it did. <sighs> God, now I really want to attack the Byzantines again, but I don't know of a way. <laughs> uh, more troops to him. Good, go. All right, I'll take it. All right, once you all all together, there we are. Combine, split off, retinue. You are the retinue. I'm gonna keep you down here. You mercenaries, I'm gonna keep you here. Cause I have a feeling Bulgaria might try some BS at some point. Uh, and let's just double check military. Yeah, the 14 is the mercenaries, of course. Okay, okay. Okay. God, I wanna go to the war with the Byzantines. I just, I want all of your land. All of it. 99%, eh? What about his heir? 42. Damn it. <laughs> I need many, many more people to help me kill these fools. Especially since my wife doesn't have a claim anymore, which is unfortunate. I mean, she's also not an adult yet, so that's also weird. But hey, she's quick, so... Yay? <laughs> oh boy, yeah, I really don't know what to do with my empire now. Many titles we can create, we got things we can go after, but all of them are pretty small. My size is too big, vessel inheritance warning as usual. Ugh. Du jour claims, lots of du jour claims. Woo, 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 woo. What's this down here? Calabria got free somehow, but the Byzantines are already attacking them. I was about to say I could move in and take them finally, but no. That, uh, uh they're not going to be a part of, or they're not going to be free for much longer. That's unfortunate. Wow, you also have an impressively sized army. Why don't you fight him and kill him and get him off your land? Byzantines, are you, like, busy fighting lots of people right now or something? I mean, not really. You have a re two revolts, but those are pathetic, frankly. Huh. How are you having such a problem with this guy? Or, well, rather, lady. Hmm. I don't know. 
Monks from the nearby Abbey have been stopping by to trade for supplies quite often lately. They usually linger to talk and exchange knowledge. I should seek their company, chance of gaining learning, but definitely gain piety. Or... Cynical. Cynical. Uh, apparently I feel the love of God, of God infuse my soul. Jesus tells me it is the only way to truly glorify God and I become charitable. What the crap? <laughs> um, okay. Oh, look, another thing. I've been commanded to give more to the poor. I cannot ignore his calling. Oh no, 50 gold. <laughs> I sneeze 50 gold. Well, right now that's what I make a month, but... Your vassal, Oot, what the hell is Oot? A revolt? Bah! Has expressed her dissatisfaction. I don't care. How dare she say something so inappropriate? You're a revolt. A carling. Of course you are. Of course you are. Boop. <laughs> How dare you say something like that to me? There we go. Now, what is this? I would like for me for me to join him in a small gathering of friends. Uh, hey, carousing! Of course I will come, my friend France. Of course. All right. All right. Oh, hello. I'm sat next to Mukhtar at a dinner when he tells me about a family of Muslims which was attacked in his capital, Aleppo. Blah, 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 blah. Such shameless violence. Yeah, it's usually what I go for on that. Do I care if he likes me? Who is he? I mean. Eh. He's a nobody person. Ah, what the hell? I don't care. Here we go. Hi, Pope! Pope doesn't like me again. Can I kill the Pope? Ooh, I could kill the Pope. <laughs> Too bad I'm already trying to kill someone else. Oh, yeah, the ask for claim. <laughs> Ooh, negative 70 on that one. And I still owe money to the Templars? How the freaking crap? Just the things. How do I pay off the goddamn Templars? I can expel them. That looks fun. Do I just donate? Will that get them off my freaking back? Will that work? I don't know. Oh god, what is this? Oh, my ruler can be married now. Ah, uh, yes, yes, yes. We are now joined. Also, check on Rome again. Nope. Still negative 10 for owing money to the Templars. God damn. <laughs> <sighs> I don't know. I don't care anymore. Okay. People usurping things. And what is this? Oh, God. Come on. Stop thinking. Oh, it was just this. He's accepting the marriage. Cool. Can I conquer your world now? <laughs> you know what? Hmm. Ah, yes, we're carousing. Good, good, good. Well, oh, God, we're at the 30-minute mark. I need to end the episode here, folks. That is going to be it for today. Uh, a little heads up on the next couple of episodes. As those of you who watch my live stream uh, already know, I'm going to be on vacation next week. So I'm pre-recording a couple of things right now. So I'm immediately going to be going into the next two episodes I'll be uh, recording beforehand. So, uh... Any helpful hit tips and uh, whatnot you guys give me over the next few episodes, unfortunately, I won't be able to hear or see or do anything about. I do still appreciate them for future reference, even though my history has shown I never remember them. <sighs> God, my brain. It remembers the weirdest of things and forgets the important. But, uh, so yeah, just a heads up on that stuff, folks. So, uh, hope you have enjoyed and you do come back for the next win. 
I don't know, I'll figure out my next step, hopefully. But until then, thank you for watching, and as always, have a good one!